YouTube. We're talking college sports in the Deep South where college football is king and on the plains of Auburn. The battle cry is War Eagle. Kennar Vernon Stewart here on the podcast real quick. Got some breaking news for the Auburn Tigers as they have landed Wesley Steiner, an athlete out of Warner Robins, Georgia. .9630 on the 24 sports 24-7 sports composite. That makes him a four-star recruit, a high-end uh, four-star recruit. Uh, currently for Auburn is the second rated recruit in this particular recruiting class. Just under Trenton Simpson, who is also a, a linebacker as well, out of Mallet Creek in Charlotte, North Carolina. Uh, Wesley Steiner is a very gifted athlete uh, at linebacker, can play multiple positions, but it appears that linebacker will be the place where he will be lining up. I would even go out on a limb and say at 5'11", 220 pounds, could probably play that will linebacker for the Auburn Tigers once he enrolls. And one good thing that this does for the Auburn Tigers is it gives the Tigers some depth to where you don't have you don't have the situation like what they will have this year where you have a whole brand new slate of starters you can continue to reload instead of rebuild at the linebacker position because in the SEC Power 5 Pac-12 no matter what conference you're playing in you know the linebacker position is very 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 vitally important and the athleticism at that linebacker position is important as well and that's what we think uh, this young man can definitely bring to the table uh, for the Auburn Tigers now if we look back to Big Cat Weekend for the Tigers now Big Cat Weekend is pretty much a a retreat type situation where prospects from all over the country uh, visit Auburn and kind of get a feel firsthand of the program and it kind of gives somewhat of a national uh, perception of Auburn you know, a lot of folks, a lot of a lot of these kids really don't might not know as much about Auburn as they would say at Alabama, Michigan, or Ohio State. So the Big Cat Weekend, long story short, just gives Auburn a bit of exposure. Now, in some kind of way, that weekend has been very effective uh, for the Auburn Tigers. You're talking about a swing rating-wise going into Big Cat Weekend. Auburn was as as low as in some uh, rankings. Uh, recruit with this recruiting class for 2020 as low as number 31 with the momentum swing recruiting wise now Auburn has catapulted almost between 17 to 18 spots ranking wise depending on what poll you're looking at Auburn right now in the 24 7 uh, composite ratings right now is the 13th ranked recruiting class in the nation still yet to sign a five-star recruit getting dangerously close though we're going to see where Auburn uh, will get this five-star recruit get a couple of those guys and continue to hang on to this recruiting class uh, that you already have and you could be looking at a top five recruiting class for the Auburn Tigers a very much needed um, talented recruiting class for the Auburn Tigers moving forward um, for the future of the Auburn Tigers because you're not going to be able to compete on a high level in power five football. If you don't have the ability to how to recruit on a very, very high level. So this is another good game for the Auburn Tigers. Uh, Definitely much needed at that linebacker position. Seems like Auburn is starting to load up on the linebackers, wide receivers and the offensive line much needed uh, for depth purposes. I would also like to see Auburn pick up on another quarterback. Because we got a quarterback battle going on at Auburn with Joy, two very, very talented guys, Joy Gatewood and Bo Nix. And let's just say one, you know, things don't go one or the other's way. You could be talking about a quarterback that could be hitting the transfer portal. So you definitely want to, on the back end, shore the quarterback position up. So you won't wind up being in a situation like in 2015 and, uh, you know, 2016 where you're scrambling for talent at the quarterback position. And that's another area in Power 5 football that you definitely don't want to have to do that. Big big shout out to the Auburn Tigers. Uh, 13th, currently the 13th ranked recruiting class uh, with the latest addition uh, to the 2020 class. You have Wesley Steiner out of Houston County, 
Warner Robins, Georgia. Leave your comments in the comment section. Once again, it's Kennard Vernon Stewart for Vernon Speaks Sports Auburn, where it's always great to be an Auburn Tiger and, as always, War Eagle.